gentlemen, gentlemen and ladies, ladies and gents, I have been reminded by somebody today, because I promise you it wasn't the first thing on my mind, but they told me that I should be telling people how much work is involved in all of this and that I should be telling people that if they feel like they need to help out especially with this lawsuit stuff because I definitely am going to be going into court after court after court oh by the way because of the interference with the system uh, the child support document is not complete it will probably not be complete until Saturday and then it'll have to be proofread so Monday is what I'm looking at to be finished with that I will be working on it tomorrow um, it's the fact that the wonderful little system now if you guys don't know about the bots that the government has and these other agencies have that go ahead and find documents and files and to erase them just by text and or information they just need to be able just like you can do a search for a document that contains a certain word they can do the same thing that's why you need to have your stuff backed up on a system that's not connected to the internet However, that may not be as successful as you think because they also have bots that lay dormant and when you connect something to something, it attaches to that something and then deletes it. So you gotta be careful is what I'm trying to say. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, the donation that people have been asking for started on May the 5th of this, March the 5th, sorry. I am tired. This is seven days a week and you guys see it you hear it in my voice seven days a week because it's for you all no matter what I say it's still for y'all um, and so they told me to tell you if you want to donate hey the buttons under there there is no set price or anything just do not choose any of the prices that are already set because you'll cause confusion all right and don't get out of control please definitely don't get out of control because I will send it right back to you I've done it and I will do it again I've already mentioned I'm not looking to milk anybody and I'm not looking to take advantage of anybody that's not what I do here all right uh, trying to figure out there was something else that I needed to tell you guys but sorry I can't focus right now because I am getting ready to lay down I have been up in front of this computer since five o'clock this morning it is four o'clock in the afternoon that's almost 12 straight hours and I am going to go lay down because I can't focus enough to figure out what I want to say next. See, that's why they told me I had to do this. Uh, I talked to the young man, his name is Mark, and he's the one who's asked me to do it the beginning and the first time. And so he talked to me. He's from back east. Really, 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 really nice gentleman. He and his wife, um, he put his wife, I spoke to her for the first time today. He introduced me to her and his word is, he's a very good man and I keep telling him I'm just a man and I am just a man no matter what else you hear me see out of my mouth that's the the final act final curtain final phrase I'm just a man like every other man I'm just a man uh, and see there's no antics because I'm too tired to do the antics sorry just too exhausted ladies and gentlemen his wife was she's getting ready to start a business that she's been planning for at least 12 years and so I gave some pointers as to how to save money and how to avoid some of the pitfalls that most companies get into that they don't realize that that's going to be a problem and she just mentioned that she didn't know she was unaware and I told her who she needs to talk to so as they can help her avoid a lot of things and I'll tell you all the same things if you're getting ready to start a business the person you need to talk to is a CPA you need to talk to the CPA as to how you can save money and what you can do to avoid certain tax liabilities. That will save you a lot, I promise you. Now, there are a lot of things that I could go over now, but I can't because I'm too tired to focus on all of it. But I've been knowing that young man because I'm helping. He's one of the defrauded homeowners of America. And most of the people know that especially those who have done consults that they have my number they can call and many of them do one guy I ain't gonna say your name James called me three times in one day because he's got a situation going on where he needed to file things by tomorrow 
And so he was calling me because he needed to get that taken care of. And they have my permission to do that. There is no extra charge or anything. No, no, because it ain't about that. He needed assistance. And I, if I have the time, I give him my time. And that doesn't mean I'm going to do that for everybody. Because look, when I'm tired like this, even though I want to give you my time, my mind is not going to allow it. My mind will not let me focus. That's why I have to sh stop this video because if I don't, I won't remember what I said last and then I'll have to go back and listen to it and that'll take too much time. So, hey, gotta go. If you want to donate, it's the same button for the consult. It's just you put in a different amount than for the consult. All right, have a good day, everybody. Got